Gotcha. The new monster, Lunastra, has come out. She's a lot of fun. And if you go to make one of her weapons, you'll notice right away that you need something called a research commission ticket in order to fully upgrade the weapon. So I kind of knew these existed, but I never knew how to farm them. I just happened to have a few. Now I'm all out of them and I actually had to go look it up. And so I thought I would go ahead and share with you guys how to get these. Basically, there's two optional quests, the White Winds of the New World and the Sapphire Star's Guidance. Uh, White Winds is going to have a bunch of threat level two monsters for them and you fight them in the arena and it rewards one research commission ticket at the end. The other one is that kind of difficult tempered elder dragon optional quest where you fight uh, Kushala Daura, Nergigante, and Teostra, but it does reward two of them. So if you're already pretty good at fighting the tempered elder dragons, I'm going to strongly recommend that one because the fact that you're getting twice as many research tickets at the end is, is going to cut your farming time in half, right? Uh, you, for me, it didn't really make a difference doing one or the other, so I, I do strongly prefer the Sapphire Star's Guidance. Oops, I am mid-edit and I decided to add a little more to this video. I wanted to make sure you guys get the information you need. Uh, I did a little bit of research on what you are required to have in order to access these optional quests. So the first one, White Winds of the New World, I believe you need to complete all of these in order to have it unlocked. You have to capture all the monsters, complete all optional quests, that includes the Zenejiva quest that you eventually unlock after beating him for the first time as part of the story. Then you have to reach research level 6 for at least 15 monsters at the Ecological Research Center. And finally you have to reach Hunter rank 49. Now I'm guessing you might be able to get around not having that unlocked. See if you're already Hunter rank 49, probably what you can do is go searching for it. Okay, so if you go searching from the uh, quest board for, uh, let's see, option, uh, the choices you'll choose is optional quest, then you'll search for like Legiana, Rathalos, Diablos, or Odegaran, and you'll see if it pops up. That's one strategy. It, the problem is people might not actually be in the middle of one of those, so, especially now that the game's been out for like uh, five months and that'll only get worse, right? For the Sapphire Star Guidance, I believe all you have to do is reach Hunter Rank 100. And I also read, by the way, that they, together, they have less health than they normally would be if you were fighting just one of them, which might explain why I was killing them so quickly. So yeah, uh, you know, if you haven't reached uh, Hunter Rank 100, you probably try to re reach Hunter Rank 49 and go for the White Sands. If you have reached Hunter Rank 100, I would do Sapphire Star and try to get the two commission uh, reward tickets. All right, and that, you know, this is a very brief guide. You know, I just wanted to help people who, you know, now they want to use the Lunastro weapons. All right, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Really? Oh my gosh, you guys! I just want to thank y'all so much. Ooh.